Hello, my name is Mike, and I'd like to tell you about the Blessing Home Centers, a ministry here in Thailand that saves and protects children from being trafficked in the child sex and drug trades. The first Blessing Home Center was located in Pattaya. In Pattaya, we have over 8 million tourists come to our city every year, and many of them are sex tourists. In fact, we have more sex tourists come to our one city alone in Pattaya than what there are residents in our home state of Kentucky. And when you have that many tourists come to one place and are predators on children, it's very dangerous for them. So when we started the Blessing Home Center in Pattaya, we tried many different strategies for saving children, including going and doing rescues. But we found that most of the children that would get rescued would eventually go back in anyhow, that it ended up not being effective. And the one strategy that was the most effective was prevention. 98% of those that we do prevention with never go into the child sex trafficking. And so uh, how we do this at Blessing Home is first, we find children who are at high risk of being trafficked. We look for what we call red flags. Red flags like if they have a mother who is a sex worker, they're highly likely to be drafted in themselves. If they have a parent or a guardian who is addicted to drugs, it's very likely they will be trafficked. If they sell drugs, very highly likely to be trafficked. If they have a guardian who's not related to them, it is very dangerous for them. And so we find those and bring them into our program. And once they're in the Blessing Home program, we get them into school. We provide all the things that they need for school, like uniforms and books and lunch money and transportation so that they can go to school and stay in school through high school because children who go to school and stay in school all the way through graduation from high school are rarely trafficked. And so uh, we also provide Christian nurture as well. Uh, we have staff and missionaries that teach English and life skills and Bible to these kids in after school classes so that they can thrive in school because children that are thriving in school will stay in school as well. I'd like to tell you about Newt, who is one of our boys in Blessing Home. He's six years old, but he first came to Blessing Home three years ago when he was three years old. When he first came to Blessing Home, his right hand was mangled and he could not use it. He could not use a crayon or a write. And so uh, Blessing Home provided the funds so that he could have surgery, so that he could use his hand now. And uh, now Newt is in school. Newt lives with his mother at a massage parlor there in Pattaya. His mother is a sex worker who never was able to go to school herself. She can't read, she can't write, and this is how she has to make a living. But she wants a better future for her son. And so through the Blessing Home Ministries, her son Newt now is able to go to school and he's not going to have the same future as his mother had. I'd also love to tell you about Garfield, a three-year-old girl that we have at Blessing Home. You know, Garfield's father was one that's in prison right now for selling drugs. He's a drug addict himself. Her mother is a sex worker who just abandoned her, left off with one of the sex tourists that she hooked up with, and left her with her grandmother who had very little income. And without the ministry of Blessing Home, she would not be able to go to school, but now she's going to school. You know, we love seeing our Blessing Home children in their school uniforms because it's a victory, because we know these kids will have a good future. I just want you to know that we could not do this ministry without you, and it's your prayers and your finances that make this possible. So we would love to have you come and visit our website at thailandmethodist.org. You'll see it on the screen and so that you can get more information on this ministry and find out ways that you can be involved and donate as well. May the Lord bless you.